Good morning. So this pitch roll yaw video is part of the how foils work video tutorial. There are two videos on this particular tutorial. The one I'm going to show on YouTube here is the it's a four minute pitch roll and yaw video. And, and then uh, here's a much longer, more in depth, 10 minute video on how foils work. And it's part of the larger learn to foil course. In the course, there are over 170 videos as of this recording, more in the works. And there are other videos that are, you know, like uh, beginner foil spots with maps and detailed info. There's also the local Bay Area foil resources in here. And there's a, a, a foil calculator if you really want to geek out and get into lean over height and, and board widths and mass heights and stuff like that. Uh, tons of good resources in here, and and so yeah, come on over, sign up for the course today, and and learn about uh, foiling. So foils have three axes of movement or rotation. There's pitch, there's roll, and then there's yaw. And for me, I think of, I think of the pitch axis as my altitude control. So I, I lean back or, or put, shift my weight to my back foot. I unweight my front foot and change the angle of attack. And so now I'm going able to travel upward or, or come further higher out of the water and then same if I want to go down, I put shift my weight via my hips forward, weight my front foot, change the angle of attack. So now I'm headed down or lower to the water surface, lowering my altitude. And then I level out and can fly at a lower or high altitude that way. And then for roll, I think of roll as my turning axis. If I want to go right, I apply, apply a little toe pressure and, and, and a slight lean of my body weight just ever so slightly. And that rolls me onto the, the direction I want to go. And I think of a, a real tight turn as a combination of all three of these. I'm rolling to head in that direction at the same time. I'm, I'm using pitch or altitude to either drive down or up through that turn and also pivoting on the, the yaw axis to really do a, a, a tight, nice turn. So that, that's how I think of turning. And then, so the roll is pivoting around here. And if we want to go, if we want to go the other way, lean that way, a little heel pressure, and then come back. And so for me, yaw is, is, it's mostly, I think of it as a surface maneuver. I'm, I'm pivoting. Uh, the board is touching on the water. I haven't caught a wave yet or I'm paddling. And if I spin real quick to catch a wave, I'm pivoting on the yaw. And also if I'm going slow and say I'm on a, a big wing in, in small kind of actually flying, big wing, small waves, kind of gutless. And I do what I call like a meandering kind of wandering turn. I, I'm, I'm not using a whole lot of roll, mostly just kind of gently pivoting around the, the yaw and doing these kind of turns that a slower, mushier wave allows. And so that's, that's also when I think of yaw when actually in flight is, is doing more of that kind of a turn. And so that's, that's pretty much it. So that was the shorter version of the pitch roll yaw video and the how foils work tutorial. Come on over to clayisland.com today and sign up for the learn to foil course. Like I said, there's over 170 how to foil videos and, and lots of great stuff there. And all the feedback I've gotten is how helpful it's been and how grateful they are to have those resources. And, and especially through the, you know, the difficult, more challenging Steeper learning curve has been a huge help. So I uh, appreciate it. Come on over and sign up today. Thank you so much.